Hello and welcome to this video and to Jeff's birthday bonanza! This weekend on and off we've been doing things that Jeff enjoys so and also we're gonna check out another one of those things that happens in Sheffield yearly that we're seeing what it's like so we're off to the Graves Park Country Show today we're gonna take little Jeff with us see what it's like there's some displays there's a dog show which we may or may not enter Jeff into stalls I think there's a fair but we don't really know so we're gonna see what it's like take him with us to that um, but yeah so Jeff is turning eight or has turned eight by the time you've seen this which scares me let's be honest but no one would ever think it would they but you're not a senior dog, are you? He, he might be disagreeing with me now. Um, and for his birthday present-ish, we have booked a trip to the Cotswolds in June. So Jeff's coming with us to that. We've actually booked into a hotel that's dog friendly. We've never stayed with Jeff in a hotel. It's normally been like Airbnbs and stuff. So that should be an interesting experience don't know what he's sniffing um, and we're going to go to the Cotswold Wildlife Park which I believe is the only zoo in the UK that allows dogs in so that should be fun um, but if you have any recommendations of dog friendly things to do and places to eat we would be grateful for that wouldn't we if he's there in fact oh, as it's Jeff's birthday video favourite Jeff moment Put you on the just, I think it's just uh, tangible. Yeah, just, not that. It's not like a moment, it's like a thing. Not, not the. It's not even called Danger Ball, that's how long he's not played it. Danger Ball. Not the howling then. You mentioned that, that one good. a lot. That was good. They don't know about that story. Yeah, I just randomly was sleeping my lap and started howling, like he kind of like straight up, nose up, howled like a, like a wolf. You've never got to see it. That was good. So yeah, yesterday, day before, I don't know what day it was, um, we took a walk in the woods for Jeff. Uh, we had a longer one, we went to see the bluebells, went to the cafe, got him a dog treat. So I took a load of clips from our walk there. So I will add those in now while we make our way over to the Graves Park Country Show and I will see what I can get for that. Again, it will be on my phone probably, so... We're going to be swapping between the two mediums, but I hope that's okay. While we're there, I think we're going to get something for lunch and have a general mooch, see what it's like. I don't know how long we'll be there for. Jeff, are you ready to go? Ready to go to the Grove Park Country Show? Yeah? Should we get your harness on? Yeah, thanks. Thanks. Love you too. Happy birthday. Sense. I don't know where the dog's going. Don't step on them. Yeah. They're looking a little bit sad though, the blue girls. But hey ho. You enjoy your treat, Jeff? Yeah, there it goes. These ones are better. It's much more. And us. 
just saw a massive hawk in these trees. Run out, and that's Velma. Right. All right, if I get Sarah to actually keep an eye on these because they can actually get underneath a barrier. So, so Luna, the little lemon cocker. Then we got Ninja, this is the boy. So it's uh, bigger, busier than I anticipated. Can I get yours? Now he's been one. Oh, they said to go to the front if you want pork. So we're like, yeah, why not, why not? <laughs> Stay where I was, just in case. Jeff is, uh... Crackling with it. Let's go crackling. Make some noise, ladies and gentlemen, for the mighty Adam Ward! I make you sound so good! Honestly, who missed any of your character flaws? Not a single one. And alongside Adam, today we'll be providing what can only be described as poor commentary. Alongside very mediocre riding. Five-time British and European trial champion, first man to make it to the world top three. But he's extremely modest and never talks about his achievements. Literally factory riders, sponsored by Alpine Star and a bunch of other people that pay me to save hands. Come on, a little sympathy clap for a guy who doesn't like introducing himself, me, Danny Butler, going to trouble. Honestly, it's really painful. We used to have a guy that did the mic, but we ran over him. Adam, over onto the first of our platforms there, across the gap. No run, no ramp, but very springy. Swapping from front wheel to back wheel. Turn himself around nice and gently. And remember Adam, Adam your next trick at the end, because that's what's important. I know you've been able to do this since you're about 10, but it's not what impresses us, it's what impresses people. Yes! Very nice there from Adam Ward. Now, all my team have got to understand this. I've got to do what he did, but on a bigger bike, which is much more difficult. Okay? Basically, I have to try harder. I'm carrying more weight, and my bike is bigger as well. So, across the gap. I'll tell you what, that went well, didn't it? That could have been me and you lying down in a &E. Right, turn it around. There we go. I'm just spotted a guy who's holding his goggles. <laughs> 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 Back leg. Hands. Take your way down. Right, Adam, I'm going to do what you did. Go backwards. Because I am. I'm going to my mum. A little bit backwards. Right, here we go. Bang. That's pretty, wasn't it? So we are walking back to the car. Car's still where it is because it was on a hill. Hopefully not. It's in the back of another car. Yeah. <laughs> um, we. Ooh, that's. That doesn't work. We were saying I don't like that way. That way doesn't feel right. We were saying that it's good. It'd be good if you had like children, but probably less good for the dog. Um, it's a bit busy for dogs. Kind of, uh, well, our dog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought there would be a bit more for him to do. I don't know why, but I just got that impression. Yeah, we've got kids, we've got the bounce castle, come the tractors to the animals, to all that kind of stuff. Pretty good. But... Yeah, I mean, I think there are things that are free or cheaper, and then there'll be for things that are paid, so like the fair and things like that. But yeah, Jeff just got a bit angsty and. Uh, he was obviously kept on a short lead. He was kept on a short lead, so he uh, got a bit upset and then jumpy, so now we've got four prints 
all over our trousers. Bit muddy. Um, so yeah, now we're going to head back home now. I don't know what time it is, it must be one or something. Can't, can't get to my time. No. Uh, quarter to two. So we were there for about an hour and a half. Uh, we probably would have stayed longer and watched all of the bike show, all of the gun dog show. But as I said, Jeff wasn't too keen on just sort of sitting and not being able to see anything. So. It does, <laughs> Again, would come back in future years, but probably without Jeff. Which is a shame, because we like a day out with Jeff. But a day out of Jeff means that you have to do a bit more moving. Pete said I had to show you the view. So this hill is the one we climbed up. I'm coming, I'm coming. So yeah, this is when we first came to look around Sheffield and we led to a park, so I'll link that vlog up here for you. And we climbed up this hill from the bottom. And it was horrendous. So we vowed never to climb it again. So another thing for the dog's birthday is we're going to give him a chew toy because he's obsessed with chewing so we don't often give him plastic toys and things like that because he can mess up his stomach sometimes. But it being his birthday and he got this for Christmas and not had it yet, we thought we'd give him this bacon scented flavoured chew thing. It smells like smoky bacon crisps. So are you gonna go on the floor? Sit. There you go. You got it? And that will keep him content for quite a while, probably. So while he's chewing that, we've got hot chocolate and a, what was it, what did you get? Jaffa cake brownie. Jaffa cake brownie. Because bank holiday Monday. So that is the end of Jeff's birthday. So have you had a good day? Good weekend? Yeah? Well, if you've enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please go ahead and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one. Bye! Say bye Jeff!